uh, what do you do in uh, Delhi? Mostly, what do you do? Like in free time? Uh, yes, in free time. Yeah, I, as I told you uh, already that I always listen English content and nothing I want, want to do. Like nowadays, you can't believe, you know, when I talk to my uh, re relatives or family members and my friends, so I don't like to talk in Hindi. I think like that I'm wasting my time and uh, yes, I don't feel good. So whenever I talk to someone, so I always say that please talk to me in English. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you? I am fine. And what about you? I am pretty good. Okay, so we are meeting first time. So please introduce yourself. Uh, my name is Vidya Ravindra Mange and I am 30 years old. I have completed MA period and uh, now I am living in Pune. But my uh, native place is in Rikuri and uh, I have done uh, MIBA in English. Okay, that's good. Okay, now I would like to tell about myself. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So I'm Manjana and I'm connecting to you from UP, District Farukhabad. And uh, I have done my post graduation in English literature from Kanpur University. I am a homemaker and if I talk about my hobbies, so I love teaching. Apart from that, I run a YouTube channel. Its name is Anjana Educational Videos. That's it. So you are from today? Yes, yes. Okay, that's good. And uh, your name is so lovely, Vidya. Vidya means you are so knowledgeable. <laughs> <laughs> Not like me. <laughs> yeah, but I love this name, Vidya. Hmm. Okay. So yeah, you are a homemaker or you do any job? I am homemaker. Okay. Do you have children? Yes, I have two kids. Okay, that's, that's good. So you have done beard. So you are, uh, you know, preparing for CTAR, TAT. You have qualified? No, I have not given any exam. Okay, okay. No issue. So what do you do? Uh, whole day like uh, you know you do your household chores after that what do you do sometimes i watch uh, english stories and i uh, i talk, i teach my students okay you take tuition i mean yes yes I teach. okay that's very good that's good so what do you teach all subject yes okay that's good. <laughs> but I'm mostly interested in the English language. Yeah, of course. <laughs> so, do you, you speak in English every time there? Uh, sometimes I speak English in English. What's your native language? Marathi. Okay, Marathi. Yeah. You know, uh, when I was little, so my my father used to work there in Bombay. Uh, there is a city, Malad. So yes, I have be I had been there when I was little. So there, everyone used to speak in uh, Marathi. So I was totally, you know, I was uh, I was not able to understand that time. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, because uh, there are many, you know, Maharashtrian, they always speak in Marathi language, but yeah. we know only Hindi. So do you know Hindi? I know Hindi. Okay, so you know three languages like English, Marathi and Hindi. Yeah. That's good. Uh, That's very good. Uh, uh, I didn't hear about your education. Yeah, I have done my post-graduation. Okay, okay. Yes. Uh, no kids? So, yeah, I have one kid. She is daughter. She is 11 years old. Yeah. And uh, so how long have you been learning this language? Mostly I have started uh, learning this language four, five uh, months ago. Okay, same here. Last five months back, <laughs> I am practicing over this language 
actually i knew all things about english but i never practiced so nowadays i'm practicing <laughs> yeah uh no, i also want to uh, learn i also want to run youtube channel but i don't know to how to uh, record the videos can you uh, tell me short record uh, recording like uh, there is option like we are talking so we have uh, many options uh, uh, below of this screen so just uh, there is option of recording and just like we are talking so now i have started recording so this is recording is carry on when we will you know finish our uh, conversation after that you can get that uh, video okay okay uh, you can record this video on uh, skype app yes yes okay then uh, do you have to face any problem uh, while uh, starting uh, uploading and uh, uh, making videos yeah yeah of course when uh, it was my beginning time so that time i was not so much aware about uh, mobile and there are so many technical things but uh, you know when we were a student that time we did not get education of computer like nowadays in a school every each and every school computer is uh, is taught by taught as a subject so yes. we we don't know much thing about uh, you know technical things so, but uh, you know i have my nephew so he helped me a lot to run this youtube channel Okay. Yeah. So he 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 helped me very much. So now, but nowadays I have learned more things. But uh, you can also learn from YouTube. You know, no one know all things about um, many things. But if we if we have YouTube, so we can just search on that platform any uh, anything you want to know. You can just uh, search on Google on YouTube, and you can find many knowledge, much knowledge about every field, and you can follow. Okay. So I think you are thinking about running your own YouTube channel, right? Yes, yes. Okay. Yeah, you can do. It's very easy. You know, when we don't know anything about anything, so we always think that it's very tough. How can we do? But no, when you will uh, try to find out, so you can get more knowledge, and you can do because everyone is doing. So why can't you do? <laughs> yes, you yes, can yes. also do. So. Okay, so what kind of videos will you upload? What are you thinking? What's it, what is your planning? Uh, I want to add some uh, English concept, grammar related, and uh, conversation. Okay. And when I want to speak uh, on any topic like uh, our uh, native place and uh, learning English language, that concept, and how to learn English, how to speak. Yeah. like this yeah 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 you can do it's very good idea and uh, absolutely we are home maker we can't go outside so it's very good platform that we can interact with different person like you are so far from here up and we are connecting with each other with the help of social media so it's very good and very interesting many times you know we love to there are many ladies and many gents they want to connect with each other Oh, yeah. it's very good we can connect with each yes. other very easily now we cannot uh, communicate uh, our neighbors yeah uh, anyone who is educated who now uh, english yeah. very well but speak with them because uh, yes yes we don't go there any uh, anywhere yeah uh, yes yes like this yes yes that's why i am saying it's very helpful for yes. uh, ourselves for you know homemaker that we are at home and we want to connect with any uh, you know uh, high advanced learner so we can't go outside but yes if we are on youtube so we many times i get email and i can also send email with whom i want to connect it's very good idea and we when we connect with others we get more and more knowledge so we can improve our communication skill also right so that's very good so your kids uh, go to school yes 
my elder boy uh, he goes to school and uh, younger boy is small he is 3 years old now he is okay, at okay okay but he is that is good okay okay that's why you are free you can do conversation yes that's good okay so how did you come to know about my channel my link i saw your uh, youtube videos and uh, okay and at that time i send you sms <laughs> okay okay that's good yeah that's good okay if you can want to ask anything you can ask what do you do for learning english um you know i remain very busy actually i also take tuition students come at my home so i have to teach and i have one kid so i have to care her and my husband and there are lot of household chores we have to finish finish so i don't have so much time for reading and writing so i every time you listen english content and nowadays i'm learning this language so i just listen every time i want to immerse myself with english and uh, i speak english if there is no one for uh, practicing so i talk to myself like i am doing work any any work i am doing so i imagine that i am talking with my friend i am talking with any youtuber or so i they do like this <laughs> and uh, nowadays i am practicing like i am talking to you so this is how practice is going on and without speaking it is very good idea you are speaking yourself yeah that's very good you know when we don't have environment so it's very good idea that we can talk to ourselves okay okay you can speak but your daughter also yeah 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 my daughter can speak because she is 11 year she is 11 years old and she study in sixth class so she is able to speak so many time i practice with her and uh, but we are you know uh, we are habitual of our native language so i think many times that uh, today i will talk whole day in english only but it's not carry on <laughs> we forget sometimes and we start with in our native language we start speaking in hindi Yes, yes so it's happening like we think we have to speak in english but we don't use uh, too much time yeah we always same year new language same year same year so i just try to talk with myself only whenever yes. i have time uh, busy with work so i think in english and speak in english that's how i'm learning mm -hmm. and what do you do what do you do to uh, improve your speaking skill uh uh now there's not i am doing anything but uh, uh before two or three month ago i was only watching uh, english conversational videos motivational speeches and uh, yeah. small uh, story english story for kids yeah 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 it's very helpful for beginner yes, yes, yes. by uh, by watching this picture we understand uh, english and of uh, which tense we have to use and uh, which tense they have used we can understand easily of course of course if you want to learn any language so if you are watching videos so it's very helpful because they we are not getting that words but they are working so we are able to understand by their work that what are they doing and how is their expression so according to that expression we are able to understand that words and sentences and we can just follow and we can also repeat imitate that's very good um, for learning english okay so do you speak with your children uh yes yes i can speak oh. my children but he they are small because uh, yes, yes. uh seven years old old and uh, younger is three years old okay 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 but uh, i speak with them yeah yeah you you should speak actually they are not able to give reply you that's okay but you will speak so they will understand because yeah. when we speak any sentence again and again and these so children are very intelligent they they grab that sentence easily yes yes 
Uh, what do you do in uh, Delhi? Mostly, what do you do? In free time? Uh -huh. Yes, in free time. Yeah, I, as I told you uh, already that I always listen English content and nothing I want, want to do. Like nowadays, you can't believe, you know, when I talk to my uh, re relatives or family members and my friends, so I don't like to talk in Hindi. I think like that I'm wasting my time and uh, yes, I don't feel good. So whenever I talk to someone, so I always say that please talk to me in English only. So I just, yeah, and you know, when I was not learning this language, I was not practicing like five months ago. So that time I was very fond of watching serials and reels. So that's how I was, uh, you know, passing my free time. But nowadays my all uh, choices are changed. My interest uh, is changed. Nowadays only I uh, listen English content only on. So <laughs> that's how I pass my time. Yeah. What is, what is your future plan for English? Uh, yes, I want to become a good fluent speaker. That's why I'm working so hard. And uh, yes, my husband also ran an institute. So many students come there. So just uh, two months later, I will join his institute and I will teach there. So that's why I'm learning this language that if I will be good in speaking, so I can just provide English environment to all my students. Okay. That's why uh, I'm learning. Which subjects they are teaching? My husband is an English teacher. He teaches their English and there are many other teachers uh, who teach math and science. So the different teacher do, uh, teach different subjects. So my husband teaches English. Yeah. Well, uh, they are uh, not speaking spoken English. Yeah, only English subject. Subject, you know, students come like nine to twelve students. So academic education we have to provide them. Subject related, uh, yes, not spoken. Yeah. But yeah, when I will, I, I have told my husband that when I will join your institute, so I will not speak in Hindi there. I will speak in only English. Because I know that when I will, I will use English, so it will be good for my all students. And they will also uh, understand and they will also reply. So one day they will not, you know, they will not uh, join any spoken classes and they can speak. Because if we provide environment of English, so students can learn easily. Yes, yes. <laughs> That's right. Okay, so Divya, I think it's enough for today. Yes, yes, yes. Okay.